This is N6PT. This is a test for the newly acquired and repaired linear amplifier, which is this one. It's uh, made by uh, RF Concepts. It's a 2 meter 40 input, 30 watts input, and 170 out. It's an estate sale, and I got it from HRO. It's going to be, be driven by my good old uh, 2 meter all mode uh, ICOM IC275 Alpha. And we'll be using the, the Diamond SX200 to measure the output. Right now, we're barefooted. We're on barefoot. We're going to transmit without the linear. And as you can see, we have we have the range sent set to 200 watts okay i'm going to key up that's about 20 watts okay being driven by this radio on 20 watts now i'm going to turn on the linear FM preamp is off. Same driving power. Nothing has changed. And now we'll look at the power output. Do this one more time. 150 watts. One more time. 150 watts. It's not max, but that's fine. I don't want to burn out the finals. If you also would like to see the power supply, here's the power supply. Okay, we are doing about the lightest busted, about 20 amperes. That's it. It was a quick fix, and now we're pushing 150 watts on FM and 160 watts oh, no you know what now we're gonna try it on upper side band upper side band that's the setting we have and the amp is also on single side band I'm gonna check the power okay this is going to be kind of tough because I have to whistle since it's a single side band. But here we go. Okay, same power, 150 watts. Let's do that one more time on single side band. Awesome. So. The linear works. Just need some more cleaning up. I just soldered the model, the board, and I saw some loose soldering on its uh, uh, RF power transistor, but it's working now. N6PET QRT.